Okay, in this video, I'm going to start show you how I run Phoenix, either IMS or the old Phoenix track in NASCAR 2003. I'll uh, start you on the start finish line. Uh, I've actually found out that uh, you really need to run this track to me sort of like a road course in that you really have to slow down in the turns. The, to get through the turns fast, you've got to actually go through them slow. Uh, I personally do not like a loose car, so you will not see me losing it, but on this, uh, this setup that I'll give you at the end, it is uh, pretty loose on the very first lap, so my speeds will be way down in that, that very first lap. Uh, average uh, speeds on this uh, 55 lap run that I did uh, when I did this recording, I'm not going to run, but just a few laps in the recording, I was actually... I averaged uh, a little over 137 miles an hour or uh, a little over 28.437, I think, was the uh, average over the 55 laps. Uh, once I learned to uh, slow down through these turns and use my brake and sort of coast through these turns, uh, after 55 laps, I still had at least 45% on my right front tire, which normally the uh, test run before this one, I really burnt the tires up, and uh, that was only on a 50-lap run. And if I'd have ran two more laps, I'd have probably blowed the tire out. So, uh, got to be fast to, uh, got to be slow to be fast on this track. So, uh, just let me uh, watch the line I'm running, and uh, hope it'll help you out on the Phoenix. Okay, we're going to start at the start finish line right here. We're hard on the throttle. We're going to cut the dip right here. I have seen the AI go plumb across that on the infield there. We're coming up to our first braking point. We're going to get off the get off the gas and touch the brake, and we're going to sort of let the, the car's momentum turn us through this turn. You want to stay as close to this yellow line as you can without getting over the yellow line until you get about to the apex. Then you can actually clip it. Let the car, I'm hard on the gas. Let the car push out next to the wall, but just be careful, don't bounce off the wall. Gonna run the straight wide open. I'm gonna probably red line just about here, and I'm gonna, as I'm going straight, I'm gonna let off the gas, touch the brake, turn the car, and let the car just sort of ease through itself. A very little wheel turning right here. Now I'm back on the gas wide open. And I go across the start finish line, and that should be about 140 mile an hour lap. So we'll run it full speed, let you watch it. Here we go. Sort of coasting, feathering the brake and the gas at the same time. Hard on the gas, push out next to the wall. Ready to brake, brake and turn in. Off the gas, sort of feathering it now. Wide open again. Point my car towards the start finish line. Boom, there's your lap. Cut the dip again. Up the hill. Hit the brake and let off the gas. Let the car set. Let it turn in itself. If you have a loose setup, you'll actually come around on you, but I don't like a loose setup. Wide open again. Out next to the wall again. Get ready for the braking point. Brake as you're going straight and then turn in. Let the car set. And this is still setting, setting, setting. And I'm feathering the gas. Boom, right on hard on the gas again. There you go. 